So Hayley, big game in the UEFA Women's Champions League. How are you and the squad feeling ahead of the game? Um, we're really looking forward to it, I think. Um, the first game was a really good result for us, a really good performance. So yeah, I think it'll be a tough test again on Thursday, but one that we're relishing. For those that, that obviously don't know the result or didn't see the game, how do you, did you fare over there in Cyprus? Um, yeah, we won 2-0 and um, I think we were well worthy of that. Um, with our performance, they, they are a good side and they will pose threats to us, but um, yeah, it was a top performance from us, a mature performance and one that we were very happy with. A lot of people winning 2-0 away from home in the Champions League will say, right, you're at home, you'll be the strong favourites. You, though, as a team, having played them out there, you know it's possibly going to be quite a, a tough game. You'll have to be on good form in this game, won't you? Yeah, definitely, I think. Um, they've got a lot of threats that we will look to nullify and also impose our game plan onto them. Um, I think last year showed we, you know, we got beat 3-0 away from home and we almost came back. So I think that shows that in the Champions League, Anything is possible, but um, I think we've prepared very well for the game and, like I say, we've put ourselves in really good position going into Thursday. Uh, just touching upon that fact, obviously, in previous you know years gone by, away legs have been tough. Getting that eventually like Stangent and really good stead to put yourself into the last 16, how proud are you of the, the squad and the performance that you gave over there as a whole? Yeah, I, I'm so proud. It was a massive performance. I think the pitch was huge. It was 32 degrees and there was a lot of challenging aspects within the game as well that we dealt with um, extremely well. So yeah, the Champions League is a tough competition obviously with um, the best teams in Europe so to get that 2-0 um, cushion, um, really proud of the squad. What would it mean to Glasgow City and to you personally if you were to reach the last 16? Yeah, it would be absolutely massive for the club, something that we've not managed to do for a few years now and um, yeah, just, just to compete with the best in Europe and to be in the last 16 teams in Europe I think for Glasgow City and, and, the, and the Scottish League would be absolutely massive. So touching upon that as, as an overall, as you say, a lot of people have maybe spoken for, for Glasgow City and other teams in Scotland about the standards maybe being weaker than it has before, but you know, proof in the sense that you might reach the last 16 of the Cup, one of the most competitive league seasons ever. How do you feel this Glasgow City team ranks amongst the ones that you've played with? Um, of course, I think before, I think the depth and the number of players you had that were international players was a lot greater, but obviously now players are, are seeking opportunities abroad and and the, the youngsters coming through are, are they're you know they're f absolutely fantastic but we maybe don't have as many experienced players in terms of um, internationals but um, yeah I don't I don't see it as an issue just now I think you know our squads very competitive in terms of well, so you've got a lot of games coming up, you know, you're still battling on three different fronts at the moment. You know, the squad that you've got, how confident are you that you can go on and achieve success in, in all three competitions? Yeah, um, I think it's no secret that Glasgow City look to go out and win everything they're involved in. And we've gave ourselves the best opportunity in the league and also the cup. And then obviously we're competing in the Champions League just now. And I think being in the Champions League improves our game, I think. Um, we have to be a lot more concentrated, a lot more focused, and obviously your, the tempo of the games are, are greater, so you're, you're raising that side of it as well. But yeah, it's something that we all strive for within Glasgow City, and yeah, it's an exciting part of the season for us.